Aquarius, welcome back. This is going to be reading August 14th through the 20th, 2023. Remember, tarot is a game. All materials solely formed for entertainment purposes only. With that, let us begin. What do we have for the Aquarius Collective? Mercury energy here, cat magic, using the resources around you at this time to make things happen. Seeing a, a spiritual book, actually. Uh, the horoscope, some of you could have uh, significantly have read up on um, the horoscopes as well as a starfish as well and a poster could be significant. Now we have fire Tom here. Using that internal compass here, I feel as if You are looking over, or someone is looking over your shoulder, manifesting, vice versa. A pearl here. Huh. Some pretty uh, big cards here, Aquarius. The path is here. The path home is here. Perhaps you are moving as well. The Sea Queen healing energy. But the resources around you to manifest whatever you desire here. Creativity off the charts light water nature all these things are here again demon cat responsibilities so there's still something from the past here that you are dealing with some kind of something very in your very nature an anger here The Earth King and the Sea Queen. Having to surrender. That's the kind of energy that you get out of anger. Strokes, these kinds of things. Perhaps you had a father who had a stroke or a mother. That's not going to be for everyone here. We have the Ace of Sea. Whatever you're dealing with oh, Aquarius, there's still a lot of love. Nurturing energy here some of you I mean that feel like you have no family and this and that and nobody loves me you know I, I'm really trying to talk to you like each and every every person as a collective but this is this is this isn't going to be for everyone right here sometimes you don't get a second chance you know to to rekindle the things with your parents there's something here about your parents are significant and if they're still here with us maybe a vacation or spending some time with them and these kinds of things there's been a lot of retaliation in this uh relationship with a mother and a father here now i feel like it can still be rekindled now for the whole collective here something is guiding you to, and it's like a calling it's like a calling. There's, just don't let the anger get the best of you, especially around difficult people because they are trying to take away your energy. Maybe not wish the best things on you because you've got, you know, a little bit of dough to take your family on vacation or something, you know. 
it just doesn't feel right under that new moon in Leo. Here's an ace of sky. So you got two aces here, Aquarius. So there's something coming in, and I'm telling you, you are going to need to protect it. This is something that you can manifest several things with the world here. You can have whatever you want here. What you, whatever you can dream of under that Leo full moon here. But the Ace of Sea, there is a vacation. Also, some about rocks and dream catchers or something like that. Buying a dream catcher. See. Anyway, and then there's the Ace of Sky, which is some brilliant idea. The Sun here, something which is very, very lucrative comes in. And the Sea Kitten. So, some of you perhaps. There is a child coming in. The chariot and the eight of fire. Now, there is something from just, you're, you're going to have to jump on it rather quickly. And you're going to have to wait August 21st through the 27th. We will have to talk about what is coming at you in the near future. Just check back. That Ace of Scott. You have a whole bunch of beautiful stuff here. Please drop me a comment. What, what is happening? What kind of good vibes are happening with the Aquarius? If anything turns out, you know, uh, let me know. But luckily there's a little bit of uh, love and romance at the, the home front here as well. So we'll see. A lot of tempers here. There's the sacral chakra affirmation. I am living a pleasurable life. I feel those aces coming in to help you live a more pleasurable life. Now we have chakra stones. Working with crystals or chakra stones is useful for magnifying or balancing the energy centra you want to strengthen. Each chakra is associated with a stone through its energetic qualities and color. For each chakra, you will find a selection of stones or crystals associated with it. Refer to the chakra card in question for its specific crystals. Chakra stones can be balanced on the body for meditation or cleansing purposes. Number five. So I feel like there's something that doesn't no longer serve you anymore or is either you are trying to manifest it into more of a successful state and either or that's um whoever's trying to learn a little bit more about crystals i hope you find it meaningful now something just hit my door like somebody was actually listening on the outside of my door so if you just heard like a knock or anything loud or move this could resonate for you as well now the chakras or maybe somebody's on the outside of your door listening <laughs> Anyway, the chakra's key concepts are safety, security, physicality, and basic human needs. Its color is a rich vermilion red, and its element is earth. So your root chakras. I'm, I'm feeling Capricorn energy for some reason coming through Aquarius. Maybe you have Capricorn in your, car, uh, in your chart. But that rich vermilion red and earth energy. So there's some earth in your chart. Overall, um, understand that there is... Um, Oh, here again. Somebody wants to know. <laughs> Crystals can be used in various ways to balance the life force flowing through the chakras. Citrine can be used to cleanse and balance the chakra as it increases personal empowerment and confidence. Yellow tourmaline is good for detoxifying the body. Amber can be used to increase mental clarity and promote confidence. Hmm. Okay. Okay, there's something that's coming in rather quickly. It's going to help you break away from the crowd. Uh, you're going to have to make forward progress. Something that's going to make you really happy. There's a truth coming in. Um, childhood, uh, the chariot, progress, and of course, the eight of fire. And it is, it's going to be coming at you rather quickly. And of course, show back August 21st to the 27th. Aquarius, I hope this helped you and for all those who have subscribed thank you and for all those that are new here everything happens for a reason uh so welcome and please subscribe right Aquarius. till next time